Hello everyone, this is Heath Johnson with NCSI. I'd like to show you another way to automatically set the cab review date for the same day and time each week. Now there's um, a few different options that I've seen or expressions, configurations on Avanti's community site and they all seem to work pretty well. Um, but one thing I run into is the offset between what the date and time that's stored in UTC or in the SQL database in UTC and then my browser offset. Uh, most of the time when I set the configurations and the dates automatically change, it works fine. Uh, but sometimes there's that window, the uh, offset. So I'm seven hours behind UTC and what happens is Depending on what time of day that I submit the change request, the date might actually be the next day. The time will be correct, but the date will be the next day. Let's begin by going to the configuration console, opening up the change business object. And then selecting the business rules tab. Now before I go on, what I'm going to do is base my um, cab review date on the type of change that's selected. So in the case that it's an emergency, it's the change has already taken place. We're just submitting it for documentation purposes. It'll set the cab review date to the current date and time so that way it can be sent off to an individual or a group that needs to prove that right away. Um, or uh, if I select major or significant, then it's going to set the cab review date till Tuesday at 8.30 because let's say that's when my my organization's cab review, uh, cab review is set, Tuesdays at 8.30. And then if it's uh, something other than that, such as uh, minor or standard, which may or may not need to go through a cab review or that approval, then it's going to set the cab review date to just a blank value. Okay, so getting back to the configuration console, I'm going to create an editing rule and we'll base it off the type of change and set the cab review date. And then I will paste in an expression and then do a quick review of it. Okay, so in this expression, the, if the type of change is an emergency, then it's going to set it to the current date and time, as I mentioned before. If the type of change is significant or a major, then what it's going to look at is the local day of week. So Sunday is 1, Monday is 2, and Tuesday is 3. So if the local day of week is Sunday or Monday, then what it's going to do is it's going to look at the beginning of the week, which is Sunday at 12 a.m. It's going to add two days, eight hours and 30 minutes, which would make it Tuesday at 8.30 a.m. However, if the local day of week is three or more, so Tuesday through Saturday, it's going to take the beginning of the week, which is Sunday at 12 a.m., add a week to because of this one, which would be the following week, and then add, again add two days, eight hours, and 30 minutes. So then it would, then the change, the cab review date would happen on the the following Tuesday at 8:30 a.m. And if it's something else other than that, then it's just going to set the date to a blank value. Okay, so let's get back and do some quick testing. I'm going to refresh my browser. and then create a new change. So my default change type is minor and as you can see it's blank. I'm going to change it to emergency and then you'll notice that it is currently set to September 19th at 10.37 a.m. which is the current day and time. If I change it to a major 
it's going to set it to Tuesday of the closest Tuesday, uh, whether it's this week or next week. In this case, it's it's a Monday, and so it's going to set it to tomorrow. And we can just double check that by opening up the calendar. And today's the 19th, and Tuesday is the 20th at 8:30 a.m. And if I go to select minor or let's say standard, it'll set the CAD review date to blank. And then again, if I select significant, it sets it to 9:20 or September 20 with this tomorrow, Tuesday at 8:30 a.m. So I just changed the date and time of my virtual machine and as you can see now it's uh, set to September 21st which is on a Wednesday at 11.34 p.m. Uh, so now just another quick test. We'll do new change. Uh, set the minor. We're going to set it to emergency. And it is just the current date and time. Let's change it to major. And so that should set it to the following Tuesday of uh, the next week. Uh, so we can see that it seems to work pretty well. Hopefully it works well for you. Um, the nice thing about this expression that it's easy to adjust. So if you want to change it to Thursday at 930, you just change the local day of week. And then just adjust the days or the hours and minutes, uh, depending on what you want to set your CAD review date to. So thanks for watching this video. Hopefully it's something that will benefit you and that you can use in your configurations. And uh, have a great day.